when they were filming at uh, uh, Disney MGM Studios. I mean, the uh, wrestling show was being filmed there. And uh, so I was all set up, and I was in in the chair for makeup every morning at 4 in the morning, and we'd work, you know, 14, 16-hour days, you know, shooting. And uh, so on Friday, the last of the week when I was there, we finished up a little bit early, so I, instead of hanging out with everybody, I took and went back over and get my gear that I'd left at the studio where they were shooting. I got a, they had contacted me and said, Bischoff says when you're finished, you need to come over uh, back to the sound stage. And I go, are you kidding me, man? I've been, you know, it was like 14, 15 hours. I've been working. I was tired. And the guy goes, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I went over there. I go, what do they want me for? He wants you to work on... Uh, then they tell me there that uh, uh, Barry's dad, Barry Wyndham's dad, was uh, one of the agents. And he comes to me and says, dish off one... And he's a nice guy, Jack was. He goes, they want you to go do a full part because it was Vader and uh, another guy... Uh, a rock and roll kind of guy that was working there, Max. Uh, oh, Max Payne. Yep. Max Payne. Who's a nice guy? But in one day, he called me all the way over there after I worked all that time to take him. He let other guys go. He wanted me to come over and do a full part. And I see Bischoff come out of the control room, then whoop, turned around, went back inside, and we seen me. And I told Jack, I said, you know what? You can tell me. Stick this up his butt, man. And that's that's it. I left at that point. So I thought that was ridiculous. I mean, maybe not the smartest thing on my part, you know. But I was like, you know, it wasn't worth it. You know, I I've worked since I'm 11 years old, whether in the business or out of the business. You know, I've always taken care of myself and my family. 